Creative Europe is the EU's programme to support culture and the audiovisual sector. It has three broad areas of interest. Culture, which includes actions promoting cross-border cooperation, platforms, networks and literary translation. Media covers AV initiatives, including the development, distribution and access to audiovisual works. Thirdly, cross-sector actions. This includes the new guarantee facility and transnational policy cooperation. The guarantee facility provides support for SMEs in the culture sector by providing intermediaries to provide loans. Calls under the Creative Europe programme are quite detailed with specific deadlines. For example, support for literary translation projects, or under the Music Moves Europe strand, training scheme for young music professionals. However, for organisations in the culture space, this is important funding and allows for the development of the sector which might not happen under other circumstances. Creative Europe requires cooperation across borders and thus creating new networks or platforms is key to success. Another point to remember is that the EU will co-fund between 40% and 80% of the cost of a project, depending on the strand, so you will have to match a certain percentage from your own resources. This can prove difficult for many smaller cultural projects, as in reality you need to have some core funding in place to effectively apply. My contact details will appear shortly, and if I can be of assistance, please make contact. A few final comments. I would always suggest that organisations, especially smaller ones, make contact with the National Creative Europe Health Desk in advance of developing an application. Far too often people spend a lot of time developing an application and get down to the details and find that they are not and they do not have the co-funding necessary or other technical issues arise. Check first. It is free to contact your help desk and that should be your first action if interested in Creative Europe.